Hello everyone and welcome back to a new episode in The Walking Dead. I'm the Super F and so we are finally arrived to our home and now let's well, look a bit around and see what's in here in this house. Wait, what? That's like, why does this have a symbol of the door? Hmm. Oh, ah, okay. Nothing. Water's off. Hope we never get desperate enough for food that this starts looking appetizing. I'm not that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. No power. <sighs> All cleaned out. to stop working a while ago. Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. How's it coming? <laughs> Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. Hey guys. How's the house looking? Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. What do you guys think about this plan of Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. How's that couch treating you, Omid? Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. Finding this house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better when we know for sure it's safe. I'll make sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Am I wrong or just the voice change of the main protagonist? Hmm. Huh. But somehow it sounded like off. Hmm. Interesting. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. Not exactly my style. Well, this is a big, big, big house, but let's go, I think let's first check out everything downstairs and then continue. Jesus! What? What happened? It's nothing. Just, uh, nothing. Just 
two doors for that? Serious? All clear in here. Just one more to check. That's the last room. Looks like downstairs is secure. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine. Honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. Okay, let's see. Hmm, loading screen. Kenny? Kenny, you okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that... like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Before it was your own son. Now it's just a kid who needs your help. You can do this, Kenny. You need to do this. I know. I just... Oh, God. Here. This'll make it clean and quick. I don't know that I can do it, Lee. I know that you can. I couldn't even help my own boy. That was your own flesh and blood. No father could have done that. But you can help this boy. Do what's right for him. Send him on his way. We should bury him. 
I'll take care of it. Oh man, what a moment. Oh yeah. Rip. But it's, uh, you know, you were lovely dog and child. Oh. Okay, now you're exaggerating. Oh. Hey! Hey! Who are you? What the hell do you want from us? Lee, what's going on? I saw someone standing there by the fence, watching us. A walker? No, too fast. Took off like a bat out of hell when I spotted him. Was it a man or a woman? Didn't get a good enough look. What does it matter? I'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us. The guy on the radio. Kenny? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't be sure. They ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We've stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well then hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No, Ben, you'll only slow us down. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Clem, honey. I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know, it. it's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? 
Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? I'm worried about Omid. He's in bad shape. I need you to stay here. Keep an eye on him. He's got Krista for that. If it comes down to it, I can't rely on Krista to do what has to be done. Not with Clementine in the same house. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. You can count on me. Good. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there, in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean... River's we... right up ahead. Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. What in the hell is going on? I don't know, but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor. Whatever, man. I find whoever's doing that, I'll ring their motherfucking bell for them. Good one. Hmm. Let's keep moving. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Oh my god. There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. Kenny, man, I don't think so. Maybe we need to come up with a new plan. This is the plan, Lee. This is our best and only shot. You said so yourself back at the house. You agreed with me. Yeah, but that was before we... And rip with the boat. This one might still be salvageable. Kenny, get a grip. This boat is totally fucked. Oh yeah? Know a lot about boats, do you? Tell you what, if I ever need an expert opinion on American history or on committing murders, I'll be sure to ask. But how about you leave the nautical shit to me? I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Well, not such a bad idea, to be honest. Not a bad idea. It's an old cash register. Not much use these days. An abandoned newsstand. Must
must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Yeah, these markings are interesting, to be honest. I'm sure we will discover what it is. Okay, here's nothing to look. Well, I think maybe later on. Could be military tags. But what do they mean? What the fuck? What is this meant to be? Some kind of warning? We'll do something like this. Okay, wow, mm -hmm. wow, that's a lot. This barricade does a good job of making me not want to go any further. <laughs> oh yeah, it really does. Anyway, I think that's it for this episode. We have seen, a, wow, a huge wall of zombies. Even though I saw this also in 300. Nice movie, really nice. Anyway, I would say not exactly a welcome banner. Yep. So I would say this was it. We see us in the next episode. This was a super F in The Walking Dead. Bye.